Two, 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 two
Hey, 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 everyone. This is Keldiar on the mic coming at you from the Seville Smash Weekly. It's April 13th. Tomorrow, April 14th, is free cone at Cones Day. Looking forward to that some free ice cream. Um, we'll get some melee action going for you in uh, not too long from now. Uh, for the time, we have some friendlies apparently between Fat Raccoon and Rurk. Uh, <laughs> but actually, we got a, a little bit of doubles action going on. Junebug and Darkseid, who I assume is the Ganon team. Because I know both of them have a Ganon. Uh, versus two guys that I don't recognize. Uh, looks like we got some new faces in the crowd tonight. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to hop off the mic for just a little bit because I have not eaten dinner yet. So, I'm going to do that. I'm going to enjoy my chicken quesadilla. Hello there, Zuzer. How are you doing tonight? Oh, 
Hello everyone, Kildare on the mic again. Uh, we got a couple friendlies for you right before we start tournament. <coughs> just some just silly doubles action, uh, apparently. Th this, this started out much more serious, uh, then they started to have fun with it. So I actually don't know who's playing Roy. I Maybe Junebug? Uh, yeah, yeah, I think Junebug is Roy.
<coughs> Alright, talk to me, chat. How was your day? Do you have an exciting Monday? Plans for the week? What are you looking forward to? What are you looking forward to this weekend? This weekend in Smash. This weekend in life. That air dodge there by uh, by Captain Falcon was pretty clutch. Did he? Oh. Oh! Oh! Oh man, Septile, that's too bad. Uh, hope it gets better for you. Got a couple more weeks before the end of the semester. You got some time to make that up. Wait, does he two Marios? Alright, so we have Mario and Roy versus Mario and Mewtwo. Well, that's a thing. Geometry. Ooh, geometry. I remember those days. It's not even meth. Nine weeks. It's like the middle of June. That's so late. That is really late. Mid tier. We got we got like three mid tiers and a low tier. Mewtwo is definitely low tier. You know, honestly, I actually think uh, I think Mario at this stage in the metagame is better than Doctor Mario. I think that um, Mario's just range, speed, and movement is better. Uh, and we're getting to the point in the game where movement is the single most important thing that a character can have. I think uh, Dr. Mario definitely has the... He's definitely got the kill power unlock. He's got some easier uh, kill setups, particularly with forward air. Um, but a, a Mario that wave lands? Just look at, look at a, a good Mario that wave lands is just absolutely incredible. Um, short hop, I think short hop bear, you can, um, you can get the IASA, the IASA frames to wave land out of it. Oof, that a raw forward smash. Ooh, that nice nair there on the landing there by Mewtwo. Oh, the bear. This is... Who? Oh, this is Junebug. This is Junebug's Mewtwo. Junebug has a melee Mewtwo, apparently. Maybe we'll get to see a little bit of that in turning. Assuming that he's not, uh, he's not practicing... Oh, the cape! The cape! <coughs> it's, all to, it's all up to Junebug now. Darkseid's not going to take a stock. Oh, no, he is. He is. Okay. Oh, the SD. Spells doom. For team Dark Bug. Good down smash. He's doing his best to throw just throw moves left and right and get them out of the way. Keep the double team from happening. That's what he really needs to do. Ooh, reach the spot dodge. More sure he's in Michigan? I don't know much about the Michigan scene. I've got one friend up there. Yes, yes, definitely. OG Scoot, hit up Facebook. Go to Smith. Uh, see if you can find a Michigan Facebook group. Facebook Smash group, there might be like a melee group or a Project M group, or it might be just like a general Smash group. 
Uh, you should also do your back to check Smash Forge. Oh, he bears it back. <gasps> Is he gonna pull this off? Dark side? Dark side. Oh, oh no, the Hancock! There it is! Oh, the Hancock. <coughs> oh, man. Almost almost able to clutch it out there. Yeah, definitely, uh, OG Scoot, definitely hit up Facebook, hit up Smashboards. Uh, if Tourney Locator. Everybody knows Tourney Locator is a stream, but we I think we all forget that Tourney Locator is a Tourney Locator. Like, if you go to... If you go to their site, they have just about every tourney listed. Uh, and I know there's Smash happening. Smash is always happening everywhere. Nowadays, it's impossible not to find a tournament. You might not be able to find a very good tournament. But you can find a tournament, I guarantee you. Oh, your boy Ness, doing work, son. Oh. Not to, but like he may have just chosen not to for so long that if he tried, he would fail. Ness, please. Ness, your recovery, please. What do we got going? Oh, this is cool. This is new. New cam. Yo, check this out. Oh, and you see that? You see that little thing in the bottom right there? That Federation gaming tag. We're around May 9th. May 9th at, uh, at John Paul Jones Arena here in Charlottesville is the showdown. It's going to be a huge, huge tournament among all the games. It's a, uh, I think it's a 13K prize pool. Uh, it, that number seems to increase every day I look at it. Uh, big games, Melee, Hearthstone, Call of Duty. Some, they're, even, they're even having some NASCAR game there. Uh, obviously, I'm interested in Melee. Uh... And I like to see the Hearthstone scene do well. I, I enjoy my strategy card games pretty, pretty well. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh! Ness! Ness! No! Ness, you were so close. So close. So yeah, May 9th. Uh, I, th I believe we're streaming that. If we're not streaming it, we, we will have like a PM side event going on. Alright, so, so Jun going back to the main. Here we go. Let's get going. <laughs> Smash God and Nick Hazard getting called out for not pausing their matches when the TO told them to. Oh. 
Tripzilla, we are starting right now. Actually, Tio is announcing matches. We're gonna get uh all right. So we're gonna get Young John and could I get the sign up sheet, please? <coughs> Did it just die? What happened? It died. I'm going to take this opportunity to grab the sign up sheet so that I know how to play the spell these players' names. That's fine. All right, so we're going to get Young John and Drag on stream for you. Uh, Young John, we know, is a is a Game & Watch and Falco player. Normally Falco, but his Game & Watch has done... <laughs> his, his Game & Watch has done some serious work. Uh, I, I called him out for being the, the fraudulent thing that it is. But it's, uh, it's definitely not something you can sleep on. So I don't know what he'll be going here. I imagine he'll be going Falco. Drag, I'm not familiar with. Uh, Drag's a new guy. <coughs> Alright, so it looks like uh, Drag is going a is a Captain Falcon player. Oh, we had we had him on stream earlier. He was playing friendlies. Okay. Uh, Y'all are good to go. Everybody's got a new tag every week. Alright, so we're going to Battlefield for Game 1. This is Game 1 of the Seville Smash Weekly. Uh, so Young John starting off with some good laser pressure here. Getting uh, good conversions off of these hits. He should grab there. Goes for a back throw. Uh, how's that? Oh, well. Wow. Early, early Battlefield there. Let's see if Drag can, is going to be able to recover from that nice shield presser there by Young John. Drag with the edge guard opportunity, but drops it. Throw, misses the tech chase. Here we go. Fucking punch there. Uh, definitely not the best choice in neutral. Uh, I, I will do that SMB, SMB and B4. I'll be sure to do that. Go for a lot of these side bees. Uh, Dragon doesn't look like he's going for, some, for very safe options in neutral. He's getting um, options that, that get him big punishes. So when he does land, it's very nice. This combo by Young John, stacking it up, looking like PPMD over here. Well, there we go, forward throw, and then stomp. Nice job there by Drag, bringing it back. Drag says, "Don't sleep on me yet." Throw, down throw. <gasps> the Falcon! Oh, what the- Oh, the reeds. Oh, the reeds. Oh, but he taunts there. Oh, man. Oh, God. Drag tell me it's worth it. It was worth it. Ooh. Young John almost getting the jab dare there. Oh, Walker, how you doing tonight, man? Oh, the 
Pause. Pause to stock. No, no, we're, we're, we're good about that here. Pause or accidental, they're accidental. Where? Where through? Oh my god, he lands another Falcon Punch. <laughs> what is going on here? I don't, I don't understand. Young Jot is not a scrub. This isn't, this isn't some scrub getting hit by a Falcon Punch. This is, this is a, a, a solid player getting red hard. Oh, the side B! <laughs> oh my gosh. There you go, young young John, trying to trying to get this back. I'm seeing a lot of rolls for young John actually. Uncharacteristic of him. Not a whole lot of wave dashing. Will you be back at nine? All right. Well, you take care, Walker. You do you. There we go, edge guard. This is the edge guard. Ooh. Yeah, Young John looking a little bit slow on his punishes. I don't know if that's a, I don't know if that's a little bit of rust or what. He is able to get that one though. Uh, he's down by 69%. Let's see what Drag can do about that. Oh, the power shield laser. Young John looking to get something going. Meanwhile, Drag using shield. He's got him off stage. Misses the knee. <laughs> Up smash. Oh, get shine out of that shield though. And okay, the Moonwalk Nair. All right, interesting option there. Uh, but I can respect the F tilts. Young John able to clutch it out. Uh, drag with a hard, hard reads though. <laughs> he got some serious punishes off of that. Uh, so let's see where he goes for game two. Uh, he's gonna go to Dreamland. Give him a little bit more space to run around. Smash. So young John with an early lead. Uh, we're going like last game. Like there, oh, goes for the down smash. But young John just a little bit too high. Uh, if he were any lower, that actually probably would have been a stock at nine percent. I like the uh, the unconventional choices by Drag. It seemed to really be throwing Young John off, and that laser actually saved him. But the Nair kills him anyway. So once again, Drag looking to get something going here. A lot of side Bs. A lot of side Bs. It's a great combo starter, uh, but very very difficult to land. Oh, the knee. Yeah, just disrespecting the shine. So the shine only works frame one, then it's just a reflector. No biggie. Just the hard read on that side B. I, I actually like the choices here uh, by Drag. Not necessarily in neutral, but on the punishes. He's going for some pretty hard reads. And he's just accepting the fact that Captain Falcon has a huge punish game if you can convert on it. See, right there. That is all you have to do against Captain Falcon side B. Shield and then shield grab. It's not hard. Uh, that's why you don't see it a lot. So it's not a very good choice in neutral. There you go. Oh, he's got another one. Tilts. Goes for another grab. Drag trying to finish this stock off, but having trouble with it. Young John actually not finishing his stock either. <coughs> that should be it. Oh no, he lets him grab the ledge. All he had to do was grab the ledge there. Grab the ledge, guys. Grab the ledge. This is the double dunk and ends up SDing. Drag with the taunt. He feeling himself a little bit. Gets the tip of that forward smash. Just the toe. Uh, that's not Zelda, but that's still going to hurt. Young John choosing the same tech option after up throw. He's always uh, DIing away and then tech rolling away. Drag is uh, taking advantage of that. Uh, Young John really needs to mix up his uh, mix up his DI, mix up his techs. 
uh, Drag's just able to convert on it too, too well. It's one of the wonderful things about Captain Falcon's speed. It doesn't matter which way they DI, you can always get a follow-up if you get the read. What's he gonna go for here? Oh, nothing. Ooh, is that bear gonna be it? That dare is gonna be it. So Young John taking a 2-0, but a great showing by Drag. Uh, best of luck to him and losers. That was quite the game. Definitely, definitely very exciting to watch. Uh, we saw we saw Drag land two Falcon punches in that first game. So I'm not sure what we've got next. Looks like uh, we're gonna get Dark Side and Smash God already. Wow. What ports are y'all in? Three and two? Four. Okay. So we got VGZ Smash God. Going, uh, I didn't see who he picked. We'll, we, we'll see in just a moment. Y'all are good to go whenever you're ready. Darkseid gonna, gonna go Falco? Smash gotta go on Marth. <coughs> Yoshi's in Battlefield. We're gonna, Battlefield. We're gonna go to Yoshi's. Uh, we're gonna go to Yoshi's for game one of this set of winners. Uh, this is, I believe, maybe winner's quarters. Might be winner semis actually. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, give me one moment, guys. Okay, so this is winner's quarters. Ooh, smash got with these reads. Dark side not doing too bad. Sticking in there. Dark side actually doing a, a recap while you were gone. Smash got SD. Uh, thank you, Doctor Money. Appreciate that. Uh, so... Yeah. Go the weight up air. Up air. Ooh. That was a good punish on that side B. Ooh, tipper for, uh, forward air. Missed the timing on the down tilt, but he gets it anyway. So Smash got evening up the stocks. Darkseid is actually doing a very good job spacing, staying just out of tipper range. Um, he's firing lasers about as closely as he can, safely. If he gets any closer when firing those lasers, then he's going to get hit. Uh, so he's doing, a, he's doing a very good job of that. Oh, the raw tipper forward, to, uh, forward smash, excuse me. The dragon killer, which I don't know why we don't use that. Why don't we call... Oh, oh, oh my god, oh, the tech! Gets him with a forward smash, but he gets hit and can't finish the edge guard. That Nair gonna take a stock, and Darkseid has pretty much evened this up. Uh, so Smash got on a, a failed conversion. Uh, Could have gotten a whole lot more off the jab reset, but nothing off it. Up throw, up air. Another up air. More up airs, just juggling him. Oh, and that forward smash will take it. So Smash God takes game one. Dark side doing very well though. Here we go. I think we're running it back to Yoshi's maybe? Uh, no, we're gonna go to Battlefield. Smash guy's got something going. He's definitely looking to control this match right now. 
Dark side with a quick turnaround there, but oh, up tilt to down air. <sighs> Finishing off with stock with style. Oh, is that going to be an S? And that's an SD by Dark side. That is really, really unfortunate for him. He definitely cannot avoid to do that. So does there with forward smash. Gets him on the shield drop, and that should be a stock. All he needs to do is stay on the ledge, roll up. Good, safe, clean, easy options. Smash got here with these nares. He's actually doing a, doing a very good job of using nair in neutral. Oh! oh okay. Oh my god. <laughs> that came out of nowhere. Just completely out of the blue. Ooh. Wow, what a finish by Smash God. Uh, Smash, Smash God turned it up to 11 there at the end. That was, that was quite the something. Wow. Wow. Uh, we're going we're gonna to see some Jiffy Cats of that, I'm sure. <laughs> the, the, the up tilt down air and up throw to down air. Which apparently is a thing. I did not know it was a thing, but uh, yeah, apparently it is. The back end of his blade, which is like behind him, it kind of puts you out at that angle. Yeah. I didn't DI it, that's why. It was straight at the angle it suits you. Oh my so. god. But it was still pretty safe. <laughs> yeah. Darkseid letting me know. Proper DI would have saved him, but he uh, just wasn't ready for it. Sort of an unexpected. I mean, I definitely wasn't expecting it. I was not expecting a down air there. <laughs> Oh, uh, so, um, this is Living Studios bringing to you the Seville Smash Weekly. We're here every Monday, Melee at 6.30, PM at 8.30. Uh, if you like what you see, give us a follow, you can tweet us out, share us on Facebook, uh, you know, do what you can, share the stream, tell your friends, tell your mom. Uh, all our brackets. If you want a bracket link, all the brackets are below the stream. Uh, there's a big link there, and you can see all of our brackets. Not just today's bracket, uh, but from brackets from every past tournament as well. So you can see who wrecked who, who got wrecked last week. Smash Guide practicing against this Game & Watch. Around May 9th. May 9th, Federation Gaming uh, will be presenting The Showdown, a big multi-game, um, uh, I suppose, not really convention, I'm sure there's a proper word for it that I just can't think of right now. Multi-game event, Melee, Hearthstone, NASCAR, which is a thing, Call of Duty, Halo probably, is competitive Halo still a thing? I don't think we have League, but, uh, yeah, that'll be May 9th here, John Paul Jones Arena, which is the UVA Basketball Stadium. Should be getting a match on stream for you soon. Got some matches finishing up over there. Oh, gosh. I apologize for that. I flew in from Boston this morning. It's, uh, it's been a long day. Real long day for Kildiar. Kildiar is tired. Kildiar is sleepy. Kildiar got back to his dorm and immediately just crashed. And woke up at 4.30. So. Match? Yes? No? Maybe so? We got a. Uh, right, Nick Hazard and Junebug. Nick! June! Green. Oh, never mind. Never mind. They're gonna. Er, yeah. Alright. We're gonna get a uh, winner semis match.
Four days. Oh. Smash got getting bodied by that game and watch. Young John might be his kryptonite. Ports. Nick. Nick. Ports. Okay. So we've got Living Studios, Nick Hazard, Video Gamers, Junebug. Alright, so here we go into game one. Going to Battlefield. Uh, it's going to be Captain Falcon versus Ganondorf. Uh, are these characters mains? Uh, but definitely characters that these guys are good with. Uh, honestly, I believe that Ganondorf is probably Junebug's second best character in this game. Uh, Captain Falcon, Nick Hazard definitely likes to play. Who doesn't like to play Captain Falcon, though? Up throw. Ooh, reads the roll, gets him with a bear. Misses that forward air, though. Wants him back on stage. Guys are looking for an opportunity. Another missed forward air with a drop up air. Good choice there. Down throw. Wait up air, but... Nick Hazard turning this momentum around. He's got something going now. Poor jab at a neutral. Down tilt. Not going to lead to anything, though. Too high percent. Oh! Gets him with the tip of that forward tilt. This is winter semis, yes. All right. Uh, joining me on the mic for a moment is going to be LS's own con man. Say hi to the people, con man. It's me. Hello. <laughs> hi there. Thanks for everyone who tuned in. Uh, pretty hype. We got a couple big guys here. Right? We got Smash Guy, Junebug. Uh, we got KLRD. LDR. L however you say it. Well, after all this time, I've, had the, I've literally had the same tag for three years. I know. And you, you still haven't gotten it. I know. I've, I've known you for two. KLD. So what, what did I say? KLDI? KLDR. Well, now now I reference the letters. So I think of the letters, and I'm like, I usually get the first two right. So I'm like, KLD, and there's something else. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> just, I don't even just, think just, of your name. Just call me Kale. Okay. <laughs> what do you mean? Oh, uh, okay. Not, uh, Nick, Nick going for the deep, deep edge guard there, not paying off for him. Do we know why he went Captain Falcon? Uh, I believe this was like an agreed upon matchup. I see. Nick I see. I said Nick thought it would be fun. Oh, we got. Oh, all right, all right, all right. So well, there's still a chance here. This is Captain Falcon. Captain Falcon is the comeback kid. Ooh. Let's see, what we got in just a range. He's got something going now. He's up here. Just that up here. Gets jabbed in the neutral. Jimbug can't forget that this is not PM. <laughs> not PM Ganondorf. Oh my lord. Let's go. Like I said, Nick Hazard only taking 27% on that stock. This is definitely in reach for him. Uh, Jimbug tends right. to really tighten up that the last stock, though. He'll, he'll, he tends to make fewer mistakes. That was a nice little... Uh... Forward throw. Oh! Okay. Oh. Tries to Scoops. get him with a forward tilt. Oh, jab! The jab. No! Jab kills. The worst way. <laughs> the worst way to go. Oh, man. Dune with those next level uh, strats. He's like, yeah, I know you won't jump on time. <laughs> jab. You're done. <laughs> jab. So, actually, it was interesting that is, uh, Nick appeared to be trying to fast fall, I guess? Because he actually oh, okay, DI'd yeah. the jab down. Because the jab does not send it that low in It's so It's soccer riding. Gotcha. As are most jabs not owned by Fox and Falcon. Okay. That makes sense. Alright, so game two, uh, it looks like they opt for the salty run back gentleman's agreement with these characters. So let's see if Nick Hazard can take advantage of this agreement. Both of these a lot guys of landing, uh, landing a couple hits in neutral. Not really getting the huge conversions though. There's one. Oh, good tilt. You've been using a lot of F tilt. Uh, yes, he loves the tilts, man. 
except does a lot with except him. For, except for up tilt. <laughs> yeah. He, 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 he'll go over that every once in a while when he knows it's when he yeah. doesn't get it. <laughs> oh, 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 speaking of, oh, oh, he did it for the stream. He did it for the stream and he couldn't get it. It was close, though. That's for you guys. Props. Props for trying. Okay. Yeah, actually, we saw uh, we saw Drag land two Falcon Punches. Oh, oh my. <laughs> That's very... Uh, it was wonderful. We got, oh, we and the got taunt. all the hype going. Yeah. If I got all the hype going. I think Jimbug is purposely playing like a PM Ganondorf because he was just trying to warm up. He's like, I'm just going to use this for practice. <laughs> well, no, he, uh, he, he likes playing Ganon in Melee uh, as well. He, yeah, he's good with it. He doesn't it. quite have all the, all the good movement options, and I know he's very side B heavy in PM. And of mm -hmm. course, it, that's not really, it's not as good an option in, uh, in, uh, in PM, yeah. it's a command grab. Right. In melee, it's, it's unfortunately terrible. not. <laughs> yeah. See, that were, that there was the go. up tilt right there, man. That's where we needed Did it. Did you have Up tilt! Oh. Jab? No, okay. <laughs> because they're trying to outspace. Just those jab strats, man. They're so fresh. All right. Scoops. Oh. Scoops. Oh. 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 Almost yeah, gets that knee. Get up attack. Ooh. All prepared. right. Good trade. Uh-oh. That's what we're going to do. Forders. Man, he Forders. Is, he's so good at hitting those forwarders. Yeah, the, the hitbox on that is enormous. True. Uh, so you you get to space it. You get to space it pretty well. I guess that's a good point. As long as you're using it the right way. There forwarder. it is. Not quite going to take the stock. Up tilt. I knew it. Oh, no. <laughs> the jab pressure. I want, oh, oh. Back throw. <laughs> He's, <laughs> He's, jab. He's getting the jabs, man. It's dip jabs all the dip jab. Oh, our back air. We'll get there. it. So this is uh, one stock lead. looking a little rough. Uh, Nick's definitely gonna have to make up some ground here. Up throw knee. There's one. Oh, okay. All right. So we're in there. All right. So we, we saw we saw them at this point in the last game, and Nick was able to bring it back. Uh, couldn't quite finish, but he did bring it back. He did, and you know, I think Nick, honestly, I think Nick Hazard's better than this. I think that uh, Nick sometimes has a problem with playing higher level players. Uh, he tends to get nervous, and like, I play him all the time, so I can like say firsthand that he definitely has the ability Ooh, to beat these guys. This could be a stock. Let's see, back air, back I think air. that was a good option. Ooh, very Not nice. Air, but oh, low. no. Oof. Anyways, yeah, my point being, rip. yeah, Nick says rip. Nick has the ability to beat these guys. I think he just has to defeat that, like, idea that he's not as good. You know what I mean? Like, when yeah. you when you go into a match thinking, I might... <laughs> when he so what does that make you? <laughs> what is going on with the screen? When you go into a match thinking, I, pro I don't know if I can win this, you... I feel like you automatically decrease your chances. All right, I'm getting on stream, playing Smash God. Wish me luck, guys. All right, good luck, combat. Give us something good. Give the people something to cheer for. Yeah, I guess to, just to uh, continue with what Conman was saying there, you know, if you if you go in against a better player, you can't defeat yourself before you go in. Uh, I was actually talking to Smash God a, a lot about this, and I know one of the things that that he just sort of banks on and profits from is people getting nervous. If you are, if you suddenly you're up on a good player, like you get these nerves, like oh my god, I might win, you know. It, it, it's you, you cannot let that psych you out. Uh, actually, I was able to take a game off of Smash God in PM, and what I did was I, you know, I just I just kept playing. Uh, let me get these names. This is Winter Semis. This is the other side of Winter Semis. Y'all are good to go. All right, so we're gonna get uh, Puff Marth and Junebug is gonna, gonna join me on commentary for this Winter Semis match. Junebug, fresh off the Ganon win. Yeah. What's up, guys? Uh, sorry, I gotta do it behind the ear. Yeah, yeah, it goes behind the ears. Uh, other way. There you go. 
These, I swear, these headsets are the most confusing things to people who have never used them. Yeah. I'm so used to them by now. Like, I use them elsewhere, not just for not just for Smash, so they're like fine, but they're, they are a little weird. Uh, so game one. Yeah. This is this is a classic Sevo matchup. Rishi electing to go Marth today. I think the last time they played, uh, Rishi puffed it out him. So, uh, <laughs> nice to see him warming up his Marth. <laughs> yeah. If anything, for the, for the sake of the stream. <laughs> Glad he didn't choose another puff Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, nice. He crouched under that forward air. That's some 30xx tech. Dan controlling center stage, not letting uh, Smash God get in. Very, very intelligent. Yeah, when, when nice Conman is careful about his spacing, plays safely, uh, he does very well. And it's very tough to beat him. Oh! No, the <laughs> wait! <laughs> oh, that, that was reads. crazy. Yeah. Okay, and now Smash God is gonna put out the wall. His wall of fairs versus Puff's wall of bears. And 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 Dan's uh, kind of going in a bit too hard against Marth, not respecting that that fair wall. Um, Jigs Jigs is really good at just controlling space by just moving around it, not necessarily right. throwing out a hitbox, but threatening it. Oh, but a nice edge guard there. Nice, right, only down nice, sixty nine percent. Although 69 oh. <laughs> ducks under the grab. Yep, that, that was almost a rest. Please. That was a frustrating thing in the world. Your character ducks under your grab. Yeah. That, that could happen in Smash 4 too. Game & Watch can duck under a character's grabs. Can he really? Yeah. Note to self, play Game & Watch in Smash 4. Yeah. <laughs> no, actually, actually, the the first time I played Smash 4, I just like went random for every single game. Um, just so I could try, di try out the different characters. And Game & Watch actually felt really good. Yeah, he, he's fun. I'm not going to lie. I, I enjoy the fast characters in Smash 4. But, uh, that up tilt going to take it, though. Yeah. Back to the match. <laughs> we melee. Yeah, we're, we're melee right now. And All right. Th that, that's a great position for Dan. Just in the center of the stage. Fading back with those back airs. But Smash God is showing his immaculate movement out of shield. As well as this, this wall. Okay. Ooh, a nice Ken combo there. Yeah, like, Conman's going for uh, things that are a little tricky. We saw, okay, two dash attacks and then a down tilt there. Uh, not sure what's going through Conman's head right now. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he's just trying to mix it up, uh, trying to get something unexpected. Yeah. Um, I saw him going for a lot of up tilts earlier uh, on, his, on his third stock, and they, they weren't really working out for him. Um, He's going for big punishes just out of neutral. Yeah. Um, I mean, if he can get this kill, maybe he can start. Oh, oh. Never mind. Or, or game <laughs> two. Or he can bring yeah, it back that, in game two. That's game two. But yeah, Smash God. Um, it was close at first, but Smash God did a good wo um, job at holding his lead, uh, walling Puff out. And um, yeah, that pretty much won him the set, or the match. And those those wave dashes out of shield, the tippers seem to be getting. Oh yeah. Oh. Gonna go back to battlefield. All right. I imagine Smash got banned. Uh, banned Dreamland. Yep. <laughs> but that's a staple. Ban versus Puff. Um, I'm not sure how Puff does on Fod versus Marth, because I know that's another good Puff counter pick. Yeah. Because but because Marth is also pretty Marth good. Marth is also pretty good on FOD though. So. Yeah. You gotta be wary of, and I know Dan is really comfortable on. Uh, excuse me, Conman's really comfortable on Battlefield. Yeah. So the, those side B's into Smash God are getting punished hard. He's gotta be careful using that pound. Wow. Oof, just raw up tilt. Taking the stock. Smash God had only taken 40 percent. This Marth is looking very crisp today. I want to see more uh, more weaving from Conman. I see him. He'll go in and come out. But, that, but that's the extent of his horizontal mix-ups. Yeah. He, the, Jigs has the vertical and horizontal game. But then even with the horizontal, he's, he's not making full use of the horizontal. Ah, you know, yeah. You know, jump in, you know, jump in place and then go in. Or, you know, like, just mix it up a little bit more other than just jump in and fade back. Yeah. Jump in, fade back, jump in, fade back. Uh, uh, a lot of puffs will go for jump in tomahawk. Which is a really good option if they're kind of respecting the fade back. Oh yeah, that would be a, that'd be a good option. I like to see Conman come do that. I'm not sure if I've ever seen him do that. <laughs> uh, well, we'll tell him later. I mean, I mean, we don't have to. 
<laughs> I'm probably gonna have to play this puff. Later. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> we'll tell him after the tournament. Tell him after the tournament. <laughs> oh, <laughs> if that reverse back here led into something, that would be really cool. Oh, yeah. And a neutral on that forward smash gonna take it. Yeah, you can't really cross up Mars Shield because that that down air covers behind him as well. String of four here's there. Oh. Two power shields. And Smash God and his brother, both very proficient at power shields. Yeah. Oh, what the guy's going? He wanted the double dip. Yeah, he, he was going for the Bizarro Classic. Alright, and it's it's looking all but over. Yeah, y you know what we haven't seen from Con Man? Ooh, Ooh, okay, that was, okay. That was a nice stock. touch guard. But you know what we haven't seen from Con Man? A rest. Yeah, um, he's crouched a few of these grabs, but he hasn't gotten the, the rest set up. Uh, does not get the reverse up B Ooh, there. The oh, power tilt. <laughs> Alright, yeah, sol uh, solid game by Smash God. And um, I, th I think we're going to play some losers matches on streams before yeah. our winners finals. I would assume yeah, so. We'll, we'll finish up the losers bracket and then get uh, winners finals, losers finals, grand finals. As per usual. OG Scoot. Who is OG Scoot? I don't know. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. Uh, I believe he's from he's uh, Michigan, is what he said. Okay. Well, shout outs to Scoot. I don't know if I've met you. <sighs> so, still still going to Zelda singles? Zelda Sheik? Zelda, Zelda Sheik, depending on the matchup. I, I prefer Zelda for some matchups, actually. For What, what would you do for Puff? <laughs> Puff, I would go Zelda. Yeah. Because it, that, that's one of the matchups. It's really hard for Sheik. Uh, it is. And Zelda Puff is honestly also brutal on Puff. Um, and you know I can kill Puff with a kick, with you know four kicks. Yeah. I just gotta land four. Um, Ice actually broke out Shielda versus. Um, <gasps> you know Hungry I Box. saw I saw a little bit of that. Uh, I it didn't get to see how the how the match ended up. Um, Hungrybox ended up learning the Zelda matchup towards the end, <laughs> so it, it worked the first couple matches. But yeah. uh, then you just have to realize that that Zelda doesn't have a wave dash, and I mean, well, she does, but you know what I mean. Yeah, if he sucks, uh, and doesn't have movement options. Yeah, other yeah. than teleport, <laughs> which I don't know if you can count. Jay Solo and Kid Dragon coming up. Okay. All right. All so right, so we got Smash God's Fox versus Con Man's uh, Puff. Oh, it's just some friendlies right now. This is not a tournament. Yep. Good. Good to get friendlies in whenever you can. Good practice. The friendlies. I, like I, might, friendlies. I might go for some friendlies. You are welcome to. Right. You got it. You got it down on the commentary I front. Down, you know. If you want to play friendlies, I could. I could commentate for a while. Nah. I'm good. When is when is ODU happening? Do we have an answer on that yet? Yeah. Mm. There are a lot of lot of scheduling issues trying to get so that. So it, it's pretty much confirmed that UMD is just gonna rep MDVA at Super Nebs. Okay. So we'd we'd be playing ODU for just bragging rights. Okay. That being Which, said. That being said. Yeah, we I'm cool with that. Haven't <laughs> scheduled it yet. Okay. They he said they're free Saturday or Sunday, and that's that's all I know. Um, I can't do Saturday or Sunday. I'm gone this weekend. Yeah, and I, most people have said they can't do Saturday, and some people have said they can't do Sunday. So um, I don't know if we have enough members to do it this week, but we could do it eventually. I mean, there's no time limit on it now. Can, can we talk about this? Can we talk about this game? Just what is going oh, on? Oh, whoa. <laughs> Yo, Smash God is getting destroyed. <laughs> what happened? Can you say fraudulent fox? Well, oh, uh-oh. Oh. Star Stalling! <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, he tried to go for oh, the optimal punish. Okay. Oh, dead. Oh my god. Oh my wow. God. Oh, the pal! What? <laughs> yeah, yeah, Smash Guy will not miss that tech. That's a st fox staple at this point. Oh. Another one? Wow. Oh, we got another. Oh my god, he's not. So wow. Fraud. Fraudulent alert. <laughs> That was that was yeah, something. Uh, R Rishi's probably gonna s play a lot of Marth today, because yeah. actually this this might be what what these friendlies are for. Because Fox 
unlike Marth, is one of those characters you need to warm up. Yeah. You, you're not going to be your best the first game you play in the day right. with Fox. It's, it's a, it's a process. It's a long, yeah. tedious process. Oh, what? But that's going to be it. If Dan can get this edge guard. Oh wow. my gosh. Dan's edge guard. That so good. Dan does get a lot of practice in this matchup, considering he lives with, uh... Yeah, he, he lives with... Wow, magic. that killed it. Okay, Jinx, yeah. This is Dreamland, but that's still Jinx. Yeah, I, I'm gonna say bad DI plus Jinx. Yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, dead? Oh, wow! <laughs> Chokes. <laughs> <laughs> no <laughs> DI. Also, this is, this is why you, you banned Dreamland against Buff. The, yeah. <laughs> they went back to Dreamland. Uh, Rishi, Rishi's pretty stubborn. Wow, and no DI again. <laughs> Just hold the direction. Oh, how did he shield oh, that smash? <laughs> wow! Oh, 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 man. Another three stack. Um. I hope ODU All right, notes. don't go to Dreamland. <laughs> Okay, fun. Let, let's see if Smash Guide can redeem himself this time. Well, yeah, chat, if there's anybody here. Uh, I should probably tweet this out. I have not done that. Let me, let me do that as well. I've been... Oh, God, I'm so tired. Really? I flew in from Boston this morning. Oh, wow. For, for dance stuff? Yeah, yeah, we had a competition at Harvard. Dang, that's cool. Yeah, we got a... We had a 5.30 a.m. flight this morning. So I woke up at 4.30. After, like, full day of dance yesterday, like, basically no sleep last night. And then it's like, fly to Dulles and then drive the rest of the way to Charlottesville. It was... I'm so tired. Uh, Damn. Yeah, that sounds... I'll just... It, you do, I'll just... Read yeah, it. yeah, okay. <laughs> I'll show it with... Does Nick have a... Twitter? He should. He better. Mm. We're gonna make him hazard. Uh, okay, that's. He's not coming up on my Nicks. So. <laughs> We're just gonna put Smash Cut in there. And we'll put you in there. Kill hey! Your, your uh, commentator for the evening. Uh, I'm at 11 o'clock ish. Oh, right! Yeah. Shine stalls. Studios. Living studies. All right. Living studies. <laughs> and we're good. All right. So we got. There it is. Okay. We're at least gonna get um, Black Magic seven four seven seven five four in here. Okay. He's he's the ultimate. Uh, stream stream monster for <laughs> MDBA. I don't know who else sees my. Oh wow, this is this is actually destruction now. <laughs> Dan showing if he's on a stage that's not Dreamland. Uh, he's getting potty. Wow. This is angry, <laughs> this smash, is angry god. smash god. <laughs> you made your god angry. Yeah, ang I've I have I've played him when he plays all out, and it's. What? It's something and else, and it's scary. <laughs> Smash God stock. sees your double three stock and raises you a four stock. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Get pink puff with Fox. That was nasty. Okay. Um, I don't know how to do that for something that's being streamed right now. So we'll, we'll just wait for the highlights. I actually can't do it while it's being streamed, you have to cut stream first. Oh, and he's dead. <laughs> 15 seconds. You call those Geico stocks. Smash got uh, getting back thrown by Puff a lot. And, oh, and the double, double up here. 61. <laughs> we call that oh, the, the mango now. <laughs> Did you see, um, oh wait, you were, you were on a flight, you probably didn't. Yeah, th yeah. there was a tournament yesterday, uh, I'm not yelling, and Mango versus Armada yeah. went to set two. Oh, and man. Mango was down 100% 2-0 game 3 and then he zeroed at Sarmada with up throw, up air, up air, up air. Oh god. <laughs> and, oh, but man. he still lost the turn. Wow. So. 
It was it was crazy. Definitely a, a fun tournament if you guys haven't seen that. I I don't know if uh, vids are up, but oh, vods will probably be on Twitch.tv slash Showdown Smash GG. I think uh, something like I think, that. I think it's yeah. just Showdown Smash. Showdown Smash, yeah. Yeah. Because I remember I remember seeing it like in the middle of packing up, and I saw that the saw that the tournament was going on, but I didn't get to watch much of it. I yeah. caught a little bit of uh, it's actually playing. Actually, actually quite a. F Few good know. sets. A lot of challenges to the gods being yeah. thrown out. Um, Fly Amanita almost took out oh, Leffen. Oh, it was yeah. That was the match I saw. Yeah. I saw. I got to see Leffen and Fly. Fly Amanita. I mean, is Amanita is so good. I I wish he wobbled. Just just because he's he's so good. Like he gets so much, so many more hits than every other Ices. Right. Just because, I mean, his his game isn't designed around the wobble, and I feel like that developed his neutral. So now he just needs to learn how to wobble, and then he'd, he, he'd be guy like. Right. I think, uh, can we get a match on stream? Alright, um, are we getting a match on stream? We should get a right match now. on stream. Okay. Uh, Dan with, the stream. Dan with the salt, but he's about to make it 2-2 if he doesn't. <laughs> oh. And he does the... I call that the MDVA, the side B from the ledge. Side B from yeah, so many guys do it. So so many d people do it. Red does it all the time. Chillin, he does do it all the time. Uh, boss, it's great. I love that he does it all the time because Zelda's forward smash just eats it. Yeah, I I'll punish it every <laughs> it's, time. It's so <laughs> easy to punish. I I'll, I'll take those free punishes against a player like Red. Oh yeah. Ooh, okay. that was a crisp wave dash out of shield up smash. All right, so we got Young John versus. Um. Jason. <laughs> Jay Solo. Jay Solo. All right. And, uh. <laughs> dude, I never knew your tag, dude. <laughs> Jay so Oh, is this going to be a Falco Ditto? I'm actually hyped for this. Falco Ditto's are so exciting. I do exciting. like Falco Ditto's. They wreck each other. Spacey Ditto's in general, just destruction all around. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I was playing Jay Solo in friendlies um, in Falco Ditto's before the tournament, so I yeah. wonder if um, that will help him at all. And I played Young John in tournament, uh, Sheik vs. Falco. That didn't go so well for him. But back <laughs> to the match! So uh, Young John will be green Falco, Jay Solo with classic Falco. Okay. And Jay Solo doing a good job of crouch canceling those Falco approaches at low percents, but.